already legends uh, do you think they need any coaching no definitely <laughs> not yeah they don't need any coaching because uh, being legends they know what exactly they have to be doing and uh, thanks to virendra sevag that i'm here in this um, you know in this role uh, as a head coach for gujarat giants having said that uh, you know viru and i go uh, a long way back yeah and uh, uh, you know uh, we have played together for the country we have uh, uh, then when he was still playing i was i already got into uh, coaching and uh, after that we did uh, uh, you know uh, we were involved in a couple of franchise in the in the ipl so we do understand uh, um, you know a lot uh, so in that sense it, it's it's uh, it's nice to be back uh, i am actually coming back into coaching after quite some time mm-hmm. because uh, uh, well i was i was trying to go towards uh, you know administration uh, having done my post graduation in international sports management from university of london but then it's nice to be with viru and uh, nice to be with gujarat giants so uh, you know more so uh mera aapse second question up लेजेंड्स लीगेट लीग क्रिकेट का नया सीजन आ रहे हैं आप कितना ज्यादा एक्साइटेड है इसके लिए एंड ये क्रिकेटर्स ये जो क्रिकेटर्स खेल रहे हैं जो क्रिकेटर्स अभी अभी इस टाइम इंटरनेशनल क्रिकेट खेल रहे हैं और हम फैंस के लिए कितना इंपॉर्टेंट है ये कंपटीशन वेल इट्स एक तो ये डेफिनेटली एक्साइटिंग रहेगा देयर इज नो डाउट अबाउट इट बिकॉज़ वी आर प्लेइंग इन सेंटर्स वेयर द स्पेक्टेटर्स माइट नॉट हैव सीन you know these legends up and, uh, up close and uh, you know wo ground mein unke sa- unke samne uh, khelne uh, itna nahi dekhe honge so in that sense i think uh, of course kolkata and delhi is different but uh, we are take we, we we are playing at lucknow we are playing at jodhpur um, hmm. and in that sense i think uh, the people would love to see uh, virendra sevag and the uh, chris gail and uh, you know many other stars uh playing for gujarat giants especially and many other legends who are playing in the legends league cricket uh itself so i think they would they would love to see them uh, play in front of their eyes uh, showcase their skill uh and it's uh, it's uh, the other thing is it's exciting as i said earlier for the simple reason that uh, it's it's uh, you know for me also it will it will uh it's it's sort of um, you know i i i'm i'm going to see how they're going to perform even uh, after so many years after having left cricket uh, at the international level mm-hmm. so <laughs> there's going to be a lot of fun there is going to be a lot of uh, a competition there's no doubt about it it's going to be serious uh, stuff uh, so but it's going to be fun for sure and ye ye competition jo existing set of international cricketers hai wo unke liye kitna matlab important rahega kya matlab wo seekh le sakte hain purane legends se about the sport <laughs> uh, well no look the the point is dekho aap aap abhi ka cricketers bolo ya purane wale cricketers you always keep learning Uh, mm-hmm. learning never stops so in that sense i think there's always something to take away from from the game um so uh, uh, but then it's a, it's an opportunity mera kya se uh, for those cricketers who have retired it's an opportunity so in that sense it's a great concept i would say the legends league cricket is a great concept mm-hmm. and legends league cricket is here to stay that's what i feel because now it's only four franchise it's on the ipl uh, model तो अभी फोर फ्रेंचाइज चार टीम है अभी उसके बाद मेरे ख्याल से पांच छह हो सकता है सो इट गिव्स एन अपॉर्चुनिटी फॉर दोज प्लेयर्स हुटेड देर स्टेट और फॉर देर कंट्री एंड हैव रिटायर्ड सो रिटायरमेंट के बाद भी क्रिकेट क्रिकेट है ऐसे अपॉर्चुनिटीज है ये सो दैट्स वेयर आई थिंक प्लेयर्स वुड प्ले दिस दिस लेजेंड्स ली क्रिकेट सीरियसली वेरी गुड टू हेयर दैट एंड मेरा आपसे एक आखिरी क्वेश्चन है दिस इज ऑन वर्ल्ड कप मेरे एक क्वेश्चन है ओके विराट कोहली हैज कम बैक टू हिज फॉर्म ही हैज फाइनली साइलेंस हिज साइलेंस हिज क्रिटिक्स एंड हिट हिज मच एंटिसिपेटेड सेंचुरी जसप्रीत बुमराह एंड हर्षल पटेल आर आल्सो बैक बट रविंद्र जडेजा इज मिसिंग फ्रॉम द स्क्वाड ड्यू टू इंजरी कैसा स्क्वाड अभी सेलेक्ट हुआ है कैसा आपको लग रहा है स्क्वाड और इंडिया के चांसेस कितने हैं वर्ल्ड कप में जीतने का well it's it's a very balanced squad and uh, the squad is uh, really really good uh, they they've got you know amazing batters in them and all rounders of course yes jadeja is uh, one guy who has missed out he would have added more balance uh, if he had to be there uh, but anyway i mean you can't uh, you can't do much about that you know, since he's injured and is out of the world cup squad and the bowling looks very good uh i think i think the uh, the the selectors have gone with the tried and tested uh, uh, players 
and who have performed in domestic cricket, who have performed at the international level, and also who have performed in the IPL as well. So uh, they've given due weightage to the performance, and they've uh, they've got a very balanced squad. And I think uh, at this point of time, if you ask me, the hopes for Indian cricket is extremely high. As I feel this is one of the best squads that uh, the selectors could pick. And uh, there's balance. There is experience. There is T uh, Twenty international experience. Uh, the T20 format itself, they've got plenty of experience. Okay. Uh, why I say that is because uh, when we didn't have any experience in 2007 in the inaugural T20 World Cup in South Africa, we won. We won that. Yes. Without any experience. So in that sense, if you look at it, I think the the present set of players have got uh, loads and loads of experience under their belt. and i'm sure they're going to uh, they're going to do extremely well uh, they're going to contribute uh, extremely well there's no doubt about it plenty of skill whether it's batting lineup or the batting depth or the bowling as well plenty of variations that we can uh, we can see in in bowling especially uh, whether it's death overs or whether it's uh, you know adding a left arm seamer in arshdeep so he brings a different angle so uh, an experienced bumra and uh, bhuneshwar kumar the only player i would have loved to see is mohammad shami uh, you know so that's a, that's a bit of a um, you know uh, surprise uh, uh, elimination or whatever you can call it as tournament it's a global uh, uh, you know on a global platform so obviously every single individual whether it be a batter or a bowler have to be uh, right on the on the money and uh, they have to they have to perform uh, it's it's all t20 is all about momentum so they need to find that momentum they need to find the rhythm uh, no matter which player we are talking about uh, you know so they need to find that as soon as possible they cannot say that okay the second game or the third game no they don't have much time uh, because t20 format is a very quick uh, format and so then they need to uh, be hitting their uh, their strides very very uh, early